everybody, Jason from Frontier Title, and we are at Model Home Monday. Today, we're with Thomas Pack, Ridgewood Custom Home. We have Elvira with Brightway Insurance, and Teresa with Extra Co Mortgage, and can't forget Andrea Peters and the Andrea Peters Group. Thomas, thanks for having us out today. Yeah, guys, thanks for coming by, taking a minute, kind of seeing what we're doing out here at Waterford Heights. We're at 4200 Listmore, and Waterford Heights, guys, is a great location. We're on the corner of Bird Pond Road and Rock Prairie Road. I mean, so close to everything in town, but let, but you still feel like you're out of the way. And so come see what we're doing and uh, check us out. We offer a lot of amenities in this home, guys, and I'm proud to showcase these to you. First of all, who doesn't like extra storage? So check this out. Underneath the bar, we have all this extra storage here. That you can put your fine china or, or things you want to keep out of the way. You can put that there. So, you know, each home is unique, and so the homes that we're able to do this on, we definitely like to have those little cool features. Uh, another cool couple of things in here in this kitchen. These are all standard items that we do in our homes here in Waterford Heights. We try to go up a notch and, uh, and showcase what we can do. So we've got the double oven here with a little touch screen. Um, drawer microwave, this is a big hit. I love these because they're great if you have kids. Think about it. When the microwave's up high, who has to put all this stuff in and work the microwave? We do as parents. So now when we have it down low, hey, tell them kids to do it. Save yourself some time. So I love that. Um, or if you're just short like me. Or if you're short, yeah. Just, <laughs> absolutely. Who so doesn't love a pot filler? If you've never had one, you're missing out. Uh, my wife, whenever uh, we did one in our personal home, I didn't know much about them, but we went ahead and did it. She uses this thing every single day. So if you think you won't use it, I promise you will. So that's a cool feature. We got a little spice racks here on each side of the cooktop. Um, Hey, if you like wine, we need a place to store it, here you go. If you're not a wine drinker, look, you can put some books or we can redesign this for you to make it something that you would use. So uh, the possibilities are endless with our setup. Uh, we try to make things easy for you whenever we're building a home with Ridgewood. Uh, it's your dreams, your home, that's our motto. And so we really take the time to go with you to the places to pick out your stuff and, and really kind of help guide you through that process. It's not just a one size fits all with Ridgewood. You know, we need to make this home custom to you. And so this is just a home that we've already pre-built to kind of showcase what we can do. But uh, hey, if you're in the market to want to do something specific for you, definitely give us a call. Another I love these windows. We yeah, I love light in the master bedroom. So we try to incorporate, you know, some smaller windows up high to get that more natural light in. And then of course, the uh, the tray lighting in the ceiling. I love it. So if you don't have kids and you want kids, definitely add this. It'll help with that. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a his and her set up in here. Uh, you know, pick your side, whichever side you want. Andrea, and right behind you, you'll notice this is dedicated for her. So a little fancy area, you can sit down, do your makeup, do your hair, Very and have nice. your own special spot there. Of course, who doesn't love a freestanding tub? Starkey, let's see how you fit in here, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, nice, plenty of room. <laughs> Mount us a little flat screen up here on the wall. Hey, Sunday morning football, cup of coffee, little football up on the telly, ready to go. This is a great feature, I love it. That's awesome. That shower is huge too. Well, well let me get out of the way and let you come check it out. Well, maybe I should be in it so you can see how big it is. Yeah. There's no turn the water on me. <laughs> it's cool. I love big showers. I'm a big dude, I like big showers, I want some room. So when you walk in this walk-in shower, notice there's no glass, so you don't have to clean anything. Secondly, since it is a big shower, we have the valves here to go turn the water on and let it warm up. So you don't have to go all the way in to turn the water on. 
hey, turn it on, get ready, get undressed, and then pop in, the water's already warm for you. Come check this out. Tons of space in here, you can see. Uh, little recessed soap dish, two shower heads, even a handheld. The ladies love that. It, you can, that way you can get the water closer to your head and, and get all the soap out and shaving your legs, whatever. You got that handheld there. This is great. Who doesn't love extra storage in the bathroom? So you get a little closet here for that. We'll put Jason in there for a. Uh... Hey, I'm just admiring the, the no glass. Believe me, that's a huge feature because I hear so many complaints at my house about keeping the glass spot free. <laughs> Which is pretty much impossible. Yes. Thomas, I love how you have the wood things in the bathroom. That well, is thank you, Teresa. gorgeous. You know, it's something too, it's oftentimes these extra rooms, your master bath and even you know other bedrooms, they get overlooked on design detail. And I think, you know what, why not? Why not add a little extra piece of a custom touch? And, and that's what we can do with Ridgewood Custom Homes. You know, with all these little things that you don't tend to think about, but when you see it in there, it's like, wow, it makes an extra big statement. So I, I love how it turned out, so thanks for noticing. That's awesome. Here's one of my coolest favorite features of this home. It, and it's something that people don't think a lot about, but when you can do it in your home, it makes it so much more functional and user-friendly user is the master closet transitioning into the laundry room. So come check. And all these built-ins are awesome. Yes. So you have the same space in your bedroom. You have the dressers, built -ins inside your closet. More shelves and then another dresser over there. That's awesome. You don't even need furniture in the bedroom. No. <laughs> Just a bed. And this pocket is awesome. doors into the laundry room. So That's our neat. laundry room, you know, you got to think about usability, space, and storage. And so having them split like that, you're able to keep all your, you know, your, where you're going to put a little trash can and throw away the lint and, and all that. So you can keep that in there. Um, you're going to keep all your, your stuff you need easy access to, like your laundry detergent, your, your bounty sheets, and things like that. That's all there. And then you can put stuff on top for easy access. I call this a folding table. You can throw your clothes on top, fold them up, hang them up, and then we'll leave it open underneath so that you can put all your dirty clothes underneath there because who hates coming into a laundry room when you have the dirty clothes sitting in the middle of the room? Mm -hmm. It's not very user friendly, so we solved that problem for you. That's awesome. I love the little mud room too. That's awesome. So is this just a closet? That's the pantry there. Yes. So we get the double doors that pop open. Notice you put a lot of extra details under the crown molding. Around that. It's really nice. Well, thank you. Yeah, so all of our homes up here will have crown molding throughout, case windows throughout, so that's the wood trim around all the windows. I like stained beams, so all of our homes have some kind of stained beam detail either an entryway and the ceiling, you know, things like that. I just think it adds a little bit more character and gives you something to, to look at and, and appreciate. Yes, so back porch. Another standard feature we do here is a couple things. First thing you'll notice is the built-in grill. So we'll have some kind of outdoor kitchen built in for you so you can enjoy that. Of course, the beautiful stained plank ceilings, that's always a hit. That's standard on all of our Ridgewood homes. And then while you're out here, most people, while they're cooking, they like to enjoy watching the football game or, or the baseball game. So all of our homes come standard, pre-wired for uh, or, uh, TV on the back porch. We also pre-wire it for two speakers. So if you're out here, you wanna add a pool, you're sitting on the back porch, you can have outdoor speakers and and enjoy being outside. That's awesome. So how many lots do you have left? So we have a handful of lots. We have one more lot in this phase that we can build in. Uh, the second phase of Waterford Heights is gonna be opening in January, 2020. So uh, we have a handful of lots over there. So we would love to show you what we have, what we can do, and our different floor plans that we can build. And just because we have preset floor plans, we can still customize those to you to best fit your needs. Awesome. Just back your <coughs> <laughs> so 
guys, I appreciate you taking a minute to stop by and check us out at 4200 Listmore in Waterford Heights here in College Station. We'd love to show you the rest of the home in person, so definitely give us a call at 979-218-2028. Hey, check out our website. It's ridgewoodcustomhomes.com, and you can find other contact information on there. And appreciate these guys tagging along today. Definitely reach out to them if you're looking for uh, closing places, mortgage needs, insurance needs, and of course, Andrew behind the uh, behind the camera there uh, is a realtor. So we appreciate you guys taking a minute, and we'll catch you next time. Thanks, Thomas. Thank you.